Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I'm John. This is Video True and welcome to Jet Set Radio, a game from Sega's ill fated Dreamcast, which, just in case you're terrifyingly young, was a console that came out sort of slightly awkwardly between two console generations, towards the end of the life of the original PlayStation N64, going into the early period of PS2, GameCube, and original Xbox. But not for long, the console not only didn't do that well, it was the last console Sega ever made. And I always felt that was a little bit sad in some ways. The Dreamcast deserved better than it got, because the Dreamcast, for its relatively short lifespan, had some really, really damn good games on it. The original Soul Calibur, Skies of Arcadia, Resident Evil Code Veronica, and indeed, Jet Set Radio, a game I've heard before, is held in high regard. Never actually played it, but it made its way over to Steam at some point, so go on then, let's get Give it a look, say. Ah, this is useful. I've got myself a lovely, friendly, helpful girl called Gum, who's going to give me a few pointers to get me started. So she's just going to do some stuff, and all I need to do is, okay, do exactly as she does. Gotcha. So she's just very kindly taking some time out of her day to teach me how to skate. So skate and skate fast and hop and there we flipping go i have got a far side acid soul hooray for me i'm amazing that deserves dance all right now it's time to get serious says gum all right i'm guessing we're about to learn ourselves some tricks oh my goodness she just graffitied that car right well that's definitely against the law dear oh flipping dear right so i'm being led down a dark path by this young lady all right, my moral decline begins. So straight past car and spray paint, hop, grab more paint. So yes, I need to get paint and then use paint to paint things and paint and paint and jump. And to read for me, I've descended into a life of crime to impress a girl. Oh, that wasn't enough. I need to descend deeper into the criminal underworld. Right, we need to do big scale graffiti. So arrows, follow arrows, continue doing spray painting. And there we go. I am thrilled with my new life of crime. Right, that's the basics. Let's get into the game proper here. So uh, I could play as beat, but no, 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 no. I think we need to play as the criminal mastermind who seduced me into this life of crime herself. Marvellous. If only because she's got an interesting... Helmet? Headdress? Whatever that is. I quite like it. And someone's busting into our turf. They're lurking around the bus route. Find red arrows. Start tagging. Okay, so. Can't tag yet, though, because I've got no paint. So instead, jumpity jumpity jump. Swingy swingy swing. Let's get ourselves some paint. So through, through, through. Giant piles of paint. Marvellous off in this direction. And, yep, there, do some painting, do some more painting. So, right, okay, now I just need to go and find red things. And excuse me, this is apparently my territory somehow. I'm not 100% clear how we calculated that, but, like, it is. And then, uh-oh, right, it's the popo. And I'm guessing they don't appreciate the actual, yeah, graffito tagging going on. Though, in all fairness, I'm not the only graffito tagger. There's, like, so many graffito taggers around here. Not just me. So I'm not sure why you'd come for me on this occasion. Like, you know, go and arrest the person who's invading my territory. Oh, there they are. Right, I see them on the move. Right, okay, so keep an eye on where they are. And stay on, like, the far side of whatever from them. So they're over there. Excuse me, why aren't you... Why aren't you arresting her? Excuse me, there's a graffiti person right there. Just go and arrest her. Right, I need to get these people off my back for the time being. So, excuse me. No, 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 no. There we go. So, now we just need to do a little bit of graffitiing. Don't know where they are right now, but they don't appear to be attacking me. Finish. Uh-oh, run, run, run. It's the police. No, excuse me. Let me go. Let me, let me go. Run, skate. Right, okay, get over to... Aha, hang on. If I've played a video game before, then that would suggest that the red things would be good for your... Yes, totally good for your health. And I've managed to shake the police. Screw you. And uh-oh, the police chief's here and he's weird looking and he's got a gun. So, they're taking this seriously, are they? Excuse me. No, no, I'm just skating into a pillar. Excuse me. Get the hell out of my territory. So, boom. There we go. So, I've chased you off, have I? And the question is, okay, so you're all over there. Hang on. If you're all over there, I'm going to come back to these ones later. Because actually, if you're there and then you guys are on the right, that would suggest I can probably graffito tag this here bus while you're on the far side of the area. Uh-oh. 
They're on the way. He's on his way. And go, finish, run. He just flipping shot me. Okay, so they really, really flipping take this seriously. Gotcha. Luckily, I'm made of like some form of bulletproof material because I was shot in the face and I took that little damage. So that's good. Right, I think he just shot me again. But luckily, he, I think he missed. Right. Oh, no, he didn't miss that time. Right, over here to this last one. And yeah, if you're fast on the graffitiing, then obviously you can get more done because he's going to try and hunt me down. All right, I see what's going on here. Although, hang on. Do I even have enough spray paint for this? Because apparently this is quite complicated. And I may or may not. Yes, I just had enough paint, but now I'm out of paint. So I need to grab more paint, then go and do... I think there's like one bus over there or something. Now there's some health there, but there's also a bunch of bad people and I totally miss the actual health. Right, okay, just go over here. I think the paint regenerates actually and I can sort of wall kick a bit too. So round two over here. Right, that's plenty of paint. And now, oh, they're right there. And excuse me, go away. Why on earth are they not going for the other people? No, no, leave me alone. Actually, you know what? Lead them in a circle. Now, if I can, yeah, loop round over here. And now I've led them in a big old circle. See if I can just do this nice and fast. So round about here. And then this. And come on. Done. And that's it. There we go. So for that, I'm officially... Right, I'm officially Nitro Set Radio. That doesn't seem as good. But you know what? I'll flip and take it. Right, and now I need to just do myself some missions taking on the various gangs. So, uh, here we go. The Monster of Kogain. Let's take on the Monster of Kogain. This is Kogain just outside our turf. The cops are onto us. Don't let him get ya. Look for red arrows. Start spraying. Right, so uh, the police are going to be present and correct here as well. And I'm guessing, aha. If I just follow the direction of the paint cans, that's probably a good starting point. So out of my way, civilians. I'm a skateboarder and thus important for reasons. So, okay. Take a left here, I'm guessing. And Oh, okay. I'm going to literally just destroy everyone's houses. Okay. Possibly the police are justified in their slightly zealous anti-graffiti enforcement if this is what happens when you let graffiti artists run wild. Right, and now we're up to... Aha! Now we're up top, we need to just get ourselves a whole bunch of just skating and right dogs, terrifying polygonal dogs and the guy with the gun still here too. So watch out for the dogs and okay, the dogs are coming for me right now and if I can, come on finish and no, couldn't quite finish. A dog is literally biting me. <laughs> Go away dog. Right, okay, need to actually get myself a giant pile of things. That's the man with the gun. He's already shot me and the dog's coming in too. Excuse me. No. And yes. And oh, that one's okay. That one's more complicated. Let that one be for now. Let's just actually clear some dogs out of the way. Excuse me. I should be able to finish this off nice and fast, right? Because it's mostly already done. And round and okay. That one's complicated and bloody hell right okay right screw it let's just actually flee in this direction right okay so now now the dogs cannot follow me and also i get a super awesome action replay and a giant pile of paint too okay so sometimes you need to just get out of dodge for a while i see what's going on here and we'll just tag you and if we're lucky, yeah, we might be able to do something. And yeah, when you start doing a big one, they just start basically coming for you. They kind of just know by magic where you're located. Get back on the skates, gun. We need to get out of dodge. Are they sending a helicopter gunship in to go and take care of bloody... Okay, but are the dogs gone? Oh, I think it's replaced the dogs. Honestly, that's an improvement. Right, the big one I started earlier. That's done. But I need to go get myself some health and some paint. And oh, dear. I'm guessing it knows where I am at this point. So, okay. Get over here and just go and get myself. I totally missed the health. I like how the walls and doors regrow if you go back down to the lower area. Just so you can enjoy smashing through them again. That's very welcome. Right, big one right here. That one's finished up. Go, 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 go. Big one over there and aha, hang on. Presumably it can't go down. Yeah, there's a middle bit right here. Oh, that's a big bloody hole actually. Okay, but it is a good place to hide from the helicopter. 
which I believe is... Well, it's not here anyway, so this all works for me. Quickly, quickly, quickly. It's totally going to, you know, come and attack me at some point with missiles and something. Finished? Ah, oh, job done. Nice. And Nitro again. One day I shall be Jed Set Radio, for now I am not. Oh, this is fun. So I don't just have to spray the graffiti in the game. I can create new graffiti. Also, by a baffling coincidence, the default font, which appears to also be the only font, looks extremely similar to the actual MATN font. Oh, there's my graffiti in the background. But first I've got to take on a rival who wonders if I can keep up with this terrifying half-human, half-bee creature. Right, well, you know, Garam, I think I can indeed keep up with you. Why don't you just show me what you got? And as it turns out, it's... Oh, wall jumping. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. I figured that out long ago by myself, actually. I'm absolutely A-OK. -okay. So just head along here. And there we go. Flippin' nailed it, Garam. Screw you. So, on to the next gang. This is Benton, City of the Night. Evening just begun, let's paint the town red. Or in my case, hot pink, because I can actually do my brand new graffiti right now, which is marvellous. I want to say right now, what I mean is, yeah, I'm going to be needing some paint first, so let's just go and grab some of that. I see some graffiti that's going to need some, and now I'm on street level. That's fine. So now, now I can just nip round over here, and uh, oh yeah. M-A-T-N, M-A-T-N, hot pink everywhere. Okay, I like the game a lot more now. I know I can do that. Excuse me, get the flip out of my way. Oh, that's, wow, you just dropped a lot of stuff right there. Flipping love it. And oh, what the bloody hell are the police ending this time? Okay, it's just basic lads on the ground. That's fine. Nice and slow. I can work around them. So take care of that. And just take care of that while I'm also, excuse me, just... Okay, not got much momentum, so let's just quickly jump up onto the roof. Lovely, thank you. Up to maximum right now. Need to find myself some stuff too. Aha, I see a whole bunch of stuff over there. Right, excuse me. Should be safe from the police up here. Right up to the point where they decide to send a gunship after me. Right, over here. Just paint that as we pass by. Down onto the ground here. Now, there's still more stuff around here. In fact, there's... Wow, okay, there's graffiti bloody everywhere. Got it. Now... Oh, the police are on the way. And they're going to try it. Oh, I'm literally saying M-A-T-N out loud. And jump up here. And screw the lot of you bastards. We've also got ourselves... Oh, hang on. There's a door up here. Oh, right. So welcome to games made during this era. At the end of the N64 and beginning of the PS2. When developers haven't quite figured out how to deal with 3D cameras. So they often struggled a bit when you got your back up against a wall. Yeah, that was something that was still a work in progress at this point in gaming history. That looks like a lot of paint, by the way. I'll just be going along here too. And aha, I know where we are. Right over to here. Nip across over to here. And yes, yeah, stay up on the roof as far as I can. That'd be a good thing to do. Hop across here. And take care of this. Lovely. Oh, yeah, this is just gorgeous right here. I want to say gorgeous. Uh-oh. It's the SWAT, right? The Popo are on their way. Yep, so they're going to start firing tear gas at me, and he's going to start shooting me. But mostly if you're on the roof, you seem to be okay. But I tell you what, grab myself some... Just missed that paint there. Marvellous. Right, get over here. That should be, yeah, that's a big old pile of paint. And, uh, yeah, you've got a bit of momentum because, you know, you're on roller skates. But if you actually start painting, that can stop you when you mid momentum. So that's kind of useful. We've got some good stuff going on here. There's, oh, bloody hell. Right, so the riot police are standing right by an unfinished one over there. Well, that's just bloody marvellous. What else do we have in this part of the world? There's... Uh, I think we're mostly okay, actually. I think it might just be that one, though. Hang on, it doesn't actually tell you. Uh, three left to clear. So there's three more somewhere. Okay, we need to... I just... Hello! Okay, just, just skate away quietly. Right, I actually got away with that one. Right, back up here. Grab myself some more paint. Marvellous. And yes, yeah, so if I actually now... What I need to do is I need to lead them away from me, so... Hello over there, police! Why don't you chase me down, you stupid bastards? Right, so lead them into this alleyway. Lead you into this alleyway too. Now, quick as we can, need to do this nice and fast. And, oh, I've been a little bit on the short side. Everything's under control. Right, just uh, escape up onto this lovely convenient. He shot me midair. What a bastard. Right, just sneak round back over here. 
quick as you like. This one really needs to be finished off. This one is apparently one I'm spending a lot of time and effort on. Come on, there we go. And in fact, I did that. Right, you can sneak behind them. They do sort of have line of sight. If you drop in behind them, they don't know about you. That's bloody convenient to know. So let to finish this big one up over here. Feels like, you know, almost done. There we go. Right, one more to go. The question is, oh, 3D camera, behave. Ah, hang on. Okay, it's up there. I need to make my way back up to the top. And also be careful because, you know, you can slide using rollerblades. Uh, so, okay, what I need to do is across to here. Now I just need to find a way to get up. Hang on, how am I supposed to be getting up? So, uh, there's a loopy uppy right there. I need to actually get my way, yeah, heading back upwards in the world. So, I need to find uh, some form of loopy. Oh, careful, bloody hell. Ah, hang on, I think I've found it. There's a little, oh, I found something anyway. This might just be a secret, but I've certainly found... Okay, ah, no, I've totally found, excuse me, would you guys just, like, mind not shooting me for a minute? I'm a bit busy. I've got to, like, you know, MATN up this wall. Right, so there was just, like, a little side area. So it's not always about doing aerial tricks. Sometimes it is just a case of looking for the stairs, which doesn't really strike me as in the spirit of the game, but screw it. Apparently, sometimes we do things the sensible way. Turns out it was a noise tank to kidnap the Gigi's pet pup, Pot. Right, we're going to murder them. Forget this graffiti thing. Get me a cocking shotgun. It's the noise tanks, those high-tech Benton crazies. Uh, and more importantly, yeah, we need to, like, you know, get our dog back. But, you know, we're going to do it by, like, covering up their graffiti. Also, they have the power to teleport. That is pretty bloody useful. Okay, so we're on a train yard right now. There's a giant pile of health over here. Remember that's there. That's quite useful. Yes, can I actually... No, I'm not actually deciding to grind across these rails. They're just non-existent rails. They're just a texture. Right, let's go get myself some paint and then get my way out of this here hole. All right, head along here. And yeah, here we go. Now we're out into a proper area where I can help myself to a big old pile of paint. And apparently people have already called the police. So whatever, you snitching bastard. Right, let's get over here, start doing some business, get round over in this direction, excuse me, and hop out and cocking hell they're sending in the paratroopers. Right, I don't know what your deal is, but I'm guessing that's bad. Also, you've still got a gun, yes, I'm sure you do. Right, just continue doing any of this business we need to do, and do some more, straight over the top of some police cars, and screw the lot of you. I need to get out of Dodge. Right, okay, so now we've snuck out of here. Marvellous. So, how many have we got left at this point? Down to 11 left to clear. Good start. Good start right there, but I am a little bit low on the old paint. And this brings me back to through here. Right, well, now I'm at an unrelated street. So, hopefully the paratroopers are stuck wherever they're stuck right now. And I am seeing an awful lot of stuff at... Oh, no, he's made it straight back over to me. But that's all absolutely fine. I've got myself up. Oh, no. No, I need to go back in that direction. And this is... It's a very visually busy game. Oh, he just cock and shot me. What a bastard. Oh, no, it was a paratrooper. Right, okay. Get over there. And take care of... They're sending in tanks! Right, that's done. Maybe get out of dodge for a minute. Pick up a little bit of health. Maybe we actually, like, you know, hide in the back areas, actually. Away from the tanks. Right, get over... Excuse me, excuse me. There we go. So the tanks are probably after me right now. It's fine. Fellow, we're making good, fast progress here. Right, back onto the street here, because I need some flipping paint. So, okay, the tanks are just going up and down, doing their own business. Now, maybe we get the hell out of Dodge. I'm full up on paint. No, no, it's fine. Ow! Okay, it's not fine. I'm on fire. Don't let them run you over. At the bare minimum, don't let them do that. And uh, if we can, yeah, just paint that on the way past. That's lovely. Now, I feel like we're... Oh, that really hurt, by the way. Still, we do have the ability to get this done. I'm guessing the tanks are on their way, but normally you get a little cutscene when that does happen, so they're not here just yet. Right, there's three left to clear, so there's more elsewhere yet, too. Also, yeah, maybe just pick up some more stuff. Look for a bit of red, if I can find any, and oh, bloody hell, there's tanks everywhere. 
Hello, there's one way over there. Hang on, I think I need to go back to the area I was in before. Hopefully the paratroopers are gone now. So this area might be... No, there is one tank. There is definitely a tank still here. Uh, hang on, where was the thing on... Oh, I see it. And I'm being shot to pieces. Oh, that's because there's four tanks. That's because there's four different tanks here. Right, I need to get the hell out of Dodge right now. And that that wasn't the right way to go. Right, how about we flee up to the top of here? No, okay, right. Tanks. Tanks are no joke. I mean, I'm not sure why they're turning on me. To be honest, I'm the one who's had my dog kidnapped. Maybe take out the other bastards. Okay, so that way leads me down into the central plaza with the paratroopers. Where does this go? Doesn't go anywhere. Oh, I'm about to be hit by it. No, I'm fine. Just... Right, okay. Almost got destroyed by train. Right, I'm guessing this is the only way to go in the end. So, uh, what I need to do now is very quickly, before the paratroopers show up, just clear out this whole area. Which is at the bare minimum, two of the paratroopers are already here. Bloody hell. Okay, just go around, uh, slap an MATN on the eight around the outside. I think it's like uh, two on each wall. And then grab myself some... I don't have the paint for this anymore. Right, quickly top up paint supplies. Uh, While well, they seem a little bit confused as to where I am. Uh, but yeah, there's more to be done. Yeah, I need to find a way to get up top. And the paratroopers up... Okay, the paratroopers are right there. They don't seem to see me very well at this exact moment in time. But yeah, we need to... Uh, we need to get their hell up top before I move on to the next area. Okay, so I just need to get over to... Oh, they can totally see me. I just need to get over to the far side over there. So go and then land and then skip over the top there. And now there we go. Now I've got myself some health. Love it. Right, so that's that done. The question is, yeah, what else is here? There's another big one up there. I kind of should deal with all of these before I move on. So excuse me. Round over to here. Right, MATN plastered right there. I think... That's the entirety of this area done. Yeah, one of them is totally just stuck up on his thing. That's just beautiful. So, I should probably, yeah, just grab some paint on the way past and then GTF. Okay, I was immediately shot. Maybe we don't bother getting paint right now. Maybe we just GTFO. Okay, so I think that should be everything in that area. Meaning now I can focus on just clearing out the street. But I'm guessing the tanks are going to be on their way moment flipping terribly. And yeah, he's already here. So there we go. Excuse me. One side of the street, then the other. And yep, the tanks are here. That's fine. Try to avoid getting hit by them, if at all possible. Right, we're straight past tank number one. And get myself a little bit of health. That's good. Any chance I can just do this one before the tanks turn around. Okay, that one's done nice and easy. There's plenty of health. Back over here too. I'm a little bit low on the old paint right now. When I say low, I mean totally flipping out. Right, get on the, the thing. There we go. That's, that's good right there. Maybe I need to stay off the ground. Maybe that's the key. So, okay. Now just hide back over here so you lose the sight of me. Now I'm back up to max paint. I need to go along the left side of the road and mop up all of that. Except, hang on, where's the... Where did the tank just go? There was a tank here just a second ago. We all saw it, right? Right, there we go. And take care of... Oh, this is going to be a tricky one. There's a tank right cocky there. And I've got an exclamation mark around me. Meaning somebody wants to kill me. Are we good? Uh, yeah, we're good. And there's still plenty of health around over here. Right, here. And what else have we got? One. There's one somewhere. Okay, it might well be up... No. It's right flipping here. It's unfortunately got a little bit of fiddliness to it, but the tanks are stuck around the corner. Unless man with gun shows up. Screw you! I have painted over the graffiti while you tried to shoot with a tank, and I am officially Jet Set Radio! Did I get my dog back, by the way? Because that's kind of what I was interested in. I feel like my character has a very short attention span. No, they've still got my dog. He's right flipping there. Go on and get your little doggy back. Oh, we've got something different to do now. We've got to tag them all from behind. 
All right, boys, what have you got here? So get behind them and... Okay, ten times each. They need to be tagged uh, from behind uh, ten times each. So get some speed going up as best as we can. And, yeah, presumably this is the best way to catch up with them. Marvelous. Try to avoid... Ah, okay, watch out for hitting signs and whatever. And then... Ah, I need to get some paint before I can do anything. So, yeah, there we go. Plenty of paint lying around here. Get some speed up. And then I imagine that'll let me get up to... Yeah, that lets me get up to you. Oh, you can't touch them. Okay. They hurt you if you touch them. So are they just going to do basically like little circuits? It looks like they're just going to do circuits or something. But yeah, if they're going to jump, then I might be able to easily get on top of them. So now I'll just get on top of you. And now... Yeah, there we go. And now if I can again... Right, they've got a moment's grace after you're done. So, yeah, if they're running and you're actually grinding, then you've potentially got the advantage. Because you can actually... Oh, they're going over in this direction now. Okay, so they've got a bit of a semi-randomized route through the city. Gotcha. And sometimes you can just... Okay, sometimes you can just get behind them. Just be careful not to actually run into them. Okay, sometimes they just... Sometimes they really just mess up and just freeze in a corner. So you can just literally walk up behind them. Which I feel like isn't supposed to happen, but whatever. Yeah, it kind of feels like the best way is just to wait for them to take a left of the junction. And then they just start all running around in circles. And then they just sort of get stuck bumbling around here. Then you can actually tag them pretty easily. Yeah, I've just got this guy twice. And then you once. And then I'm just literally standing here. Right, so I've got, I've got four tags. Five. Yeah, okay, you definitely just want to lead them to this point. So the AI can't really deal with the fact it's supposed to be being, you know, chased and trying to stay away from you. It struggles with that a little bit. So yeah, the easiest way to get a bit of speed on them is to just slide down the railing. And then you can get on top of this guy like this. And then it's just a question of, yeah, there we go. You can get one right there. That's not too difficult at all. If you just, yeah, stay on the outside rail and then use the speed and the jump to ascend the stairs faster than they can. Then you've just got to make sure you don't accidentally walk into them because they'll just do damage to you. But yeah, okay. Now say the easiest way is just wait for them to turn left and then just ambush them at the stairs. Well, they seem to be completely clueless. Yeah, there we go. Right here. All right, you stupid losers. Now, how about you just bumble around right here for a couple of minutes while I just spray you all in the back? Ah, hello, old friends. So how about you just stand, yeah, right here. Right here would be marvellous. Now, how about you all just come over here too? There we go. Just keep spraying you bastards a little bit. Lovely. And down the last one goes. That was definitely not how you were supposed to do it, but the game has declared me a jet set radio, and I'll presumably get my dog back. So that's good. The GG's dog got home safe and sound, but it looks like the noise tanks made some modifications. Now it moves like a cow. I wonder if they can milk it too. Okay, so I've got my dog bag, but it's been cybernetically modified so it thinks it's... it's a cow. Uh, okay, well, at least he's back. That's good, I suppose. But you know what, ladies and gentlemen, I think you get the point. This here is Jet Set Radio, and okay, it's showing its age. It is showing its age in some ways. It's a bit scruffy. The camera is most definitely from an era before a lot of dev teams figured out how to make cameras work in three-dimensional space. There are a few small technical issues, but the core game is still fast and interesting and stylish and uh, thank goodness it's cell shaded because games of this era that decided to cell shade, they have aged so much better than their contemporaries. Jet Set Radio, Zelda Wind Waker, they still look just fine today. So yeah, Jet Set Radio, an odd little beast, but I'm glad I found the time to go back and check it out. If you're nostalgic for this one, if you were one of the 17 Dreamcast owners that existed in the entire world, you might well be interested in this. It's over on Steam right now, link in the description below, just in case you're interested. I do enjoy diving in to all little bits of console generation history. Long may it continue. But in the meantime, I've been John. This has been many a true nut. This has been J Jet Set Radio. Thank you very much, and goodbye. Jebediah Kerman has not exploded. Oh shit. What did that happen? Five, four, three. Oh, I forgot to turn the thrust on. Five, four. Is everything else? How is everything? Up to that point, that was going better than anyone expected.